This morning in the Eagle Studio, Jeff Dirksen with us. Jeff, good morning. Good morning, Ronnie. And Jeff, you along with your wife, Linda, our owner-operator of Tim Hortons and Winkler, Morden, and Carmen. Jeff, how long have you guys been doing Tim Hortons? This is our uh, 20th year, Ronnie. 20 years. Yep. And so reflecting back on 20 years, you know, how does that make you feel? You know, 20 years of doing this. It's uh, It's been a, a crazy, crazy ride. Um, it, all, all good. And uh, lots of learnings and uh, two two great communities and, and of course we've just added Carmen in the last couple of years and and that's uh and that's a great great place to be as well and uh, part of uh, you know tim hortons is doing special campaigns like something like the smile cookie campaign and it's here once again jeff when does smile cookie start starts on monday uh april 29th runs through till uh, sunday may 5th um cookies cookies will be available for uh, everybody for uh for the week and looking forward to to making some thousands of cookies yeah thousands of cookies, thousands it, sure, of cookies. it sure will be and some people might think yeah. you know well tim Hortons has treats like cookies all the time what makes you know a smile cookie special well who doesn't like a smile yeah. um our our uh, we have a great our team has a great week uh we have volunteers in to help us produce cookies volunteers are from the community uh from the charity um They'll come in, spend a couple hours, help us uh, get some cookies produced and, and have some, some laughs and smiles, of course. And uh, yeah, it makes it all a great week. Yeah, and I've been uh, inside the Tim Hortons there while some volunteers are making the smile cookies, and it's always like the first one doesn't turn out the best, but by the end of it, they're they're popping the eyes and the smile really, really well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's the occasional cookie that uh, that um, falls a little bit short of a smile, but uh, it, it's all fun doing them, and uh, everybody has a blast. Each of them are uh, are certainly unique, and this year uh, you guys are supporting the Bounty Shells Health Center Foundation. Uh, talk about the the foundation and how you guys ended up supporting them this year. Um, just a, a great cause. They're doing some some big changes out there um, at the corner of, of three and and uh, um, fourteen, where uh, everybody drives by it most every day, and it affects everybody in our communities. Um, just seemed like a, a great fit and uh, a perfect time to uh, to jump in and uh, do some work with these guys. And what's great about the uh, the Smile Cookie campaign is that it's not uh, you know a portion of it; it's 100% of the uh, of the Smile Cookie goes towards the BTHC Foundation. That's right, dollar uh, fifty for a cookie. Every um, every bit of that dollar fifty goes to the Boundary Trails Foundation. And you can order one, or you can order them by the dozen. And Jeff, right now people can pre-order. Indeed, there's uh, pre-order forms available on the Boundary Trails Healthcare Foundation's uh, website. Please. Uh, Go there, check it out, um, fill one out, tell us when you want to pick them up, and uh, they'll be ready for you. There we go, Jeff. Well, thank you so much for uh, for coming in this morning. We're excited for Smile Cookie Week. Thanks again, Ronnie. Appreciate it. Hey, I'm Ronnie Gunther. Hopefully you enjoyed that video. If you have something going on in the community and you want to share it on the morning show, we'd love to have you. Send us an email at news at PeminaValleyOnline.com. If you like the video, give it a like and share it with your friends. We'll see you next time.